Hey guys, what's going on? Richard here, and I'm back with another TF2 commentary, and today, I'm gonna be bringing a second video for you guys today. <laughs> wow, it's like Christmas or something. But, uh, there was an update today on regarding the Festivizers, or what is now known as the Festivizers. So these Smiths Miss mystery gifts are Festivizers, and I've collected all the, uh, skinned weapons I have over the time, uh, over the gunmetal and tough break. I- oh, I just have these cosmetics here, I guess, whoops. But uh, I have collected all the skinned weapons that I have, or decorated weapons, and we're going to apply these festivizers to them. So if you guys didn't know, or if you didn't see the video today, I unboxed some cases, and along with the cases, you got a festive mystery gift. And these are actually open, you can actually open them now, and uh, if we open them, let's see, we will get, um, let's see. What do we get? We get? Oh, we get a festivizer. It's a gunmetal and a tough break festivizer. So basically, you can festivize any weapon from the collection, from the tough break, from the gunmetal, from the warbird, anything that is a decorated weapon. You can apparently make festive now, which is absolutely awesome. So I'm going to pick out some of my favorite skins and make them festive. So I'm just going to speed up this process here. And then I will see you when we're done. Alright guys, so I'm back. I unboxed all the mystery gifts or Smith Smith festive gifts and I've gotten seven of the festivizers for the gunmetal and tough break update. So I guess Valve this year decided not to make new festive weapons, which I'm a bit disappointed about if this is going to be the quote unquote Smith Smith update because I was expecting new festive weapons. I don't know if you guys saw Grizzly Berry's video and Scott Jaws, but there's just tons of people talking about uh, expectations for new festive weapons this year and I guess Valve is not going to be delivering on that so I, I'm going to be kind of disappointed about that but I guess I will just have to be opening more war Warbird and Pyroland cases but I'm going to apply these to a few of the weapons here that I actually really do like so I'm going to put it to the lightning rod the let's see the sweet dreams grenade launcher uh, the knife and I'm going to keep the rest to apply to other weapons down the road. So that does mean I'll have another unboxing video down the road to open up some of the other cases, or I mean the Warbird and the Pyroland cases, to get more festivizers and potentially a better weapon to festivize. So let's first festivize this Lightning Rod, which is Factory New, which was one of my favorite skins out of the gunmetal collection since the gunmetal weapon skins like I talked about were okay. So okay, so the HUD's broken. Well that's to be expected. So let's see what let's let's see what this looks like. Alright, so it's festive. Looks pretty cool. I like it. I like it. Oh this would be really good to put an unusual weapon, which I've already seen a few friends do. So let's see. Alright, let's put that right there. Oh, there's a glitch where it disappeared. Oh no. Scary. Uh probably just went back to this page somewhere. Right? Yeah, I just went right back here. Okay, um, let's put this on the grenade launcher here, and let's see what it looks like. Sweet. Alright, this is a pink. Let's bring this back, and let's inspect it. And uh, yeah, it looks pretty sick. I like it. And finally, let's apply this one to, let's see here, what do we want to apply it to? Let's see, what's our best quality weapon we have on us right now? Um, this is Battle Square. Oh, I'll definitely put it on the uh, Rocket Launcher as well. The powerhouse Collection Rocket Launcher. I think this is... I, forgot, I think this is an Aquamarine? What is this? Yeah, Aquamarine. Alright, let's see. Let's put this back on this page. Alright, so it's pretty sick. I like this idea, although I am disappointed about the non fest weapons. This kind of gives you... Uh, more options on what you want to specifically festivize, including your favorite skins. So I like that Valve's given us a bit more freedom on what weapons we want to make festive, but I'm kind of sad there aren't new festive weapons like a festive Kritzkrieg or a festive watch or anything like that. But uh, I'm going to place some background gameplay here of the new weapons and what they look like in-game. But let me know what you guys think about the new festive, or festivizers, excuse me, and what do you think about 
there not being new festive weapons and instead you get to choose your own, which like I said before, I do like since it gives you a bit more uh, freedom to choose what you want to make festive, but still disappointed. I, I'm still going to be satisfied with this, uh, definitely for sure, since I like the opportunity to choose what I want to make festive, since I kind of like to... It's, I'm a lone wolf. We're not really a lone wolf, but I like to make my own decisions. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys are going to festivize. And this is Richo, signing off.